here on Mount Hood, the snow has been coming down. It's awesome. We needed the snow, so this is great for skiing. But there is a flip side. So much snow means avalanche danger is high. It definitely makes me more scared to go out. On Wednesday, a Mount Hood Meadows ski patroller got caught in an avalanche. It was in an area known as God's Wall, closed to the general public. Ski patrollers were out checking the stability of the snow for a possible opening. It is concerning, especially when the experts, people who are supposed to be experts in it, um, have issues. But the job of a ski patroller is a more dangerous one to begin with, and fortunately, he was equipped with all the right gear. One of the items, an avalanche airbag. He deployed it right away. An AMR paramedic shows how it's used in this video. Airbags are inflated to keep skiers and snowboarders near the top of the moving snow instead of getting pulled under. But it's definitely scary hearing that kind of stuff because that could happen to any of us. Still, there are ways to keep yourself safe when venturing off trail. You turn it on and it's transmitting right away. Carrie Noland, an AMR paramedic, is also an experienced skier. He knows all about avalanche danger. But they can take out you know, cars, trucks, homes, even very portions of towns, depending on the size. So yeah, they can be extremely powerful. But he says having the right precautions and gear overall, not just that avalanche airbag, is key. Um, there are many other things that you should have uh, before you go to the airbag. You know, there's a shovel, a probe, the transceivers and beacons. Those are all things Archuleta is now thinking she might get. I just hope that everyone can stay safe out there. Just in case. Well, having the right gear is great. It's also equally important to go out with a buddy and never lose sight of each other. The ski patroller involved in this particular avalanche, snow only covered his legs and he didn't have to be dug out. But if the situation were different and if he had been buried, if there were people around to help, it could have made all the difference. Back to you.